The side menu is a great way of adding a lot of functionality without taking up a lot of real estate. It's an easy element to add in Ionic and can be designed to slide out from the left or the right. We'll start with a basic Ionic app with a controller. I've already added a header with a button for showing the side menu. To start, let's add a click action for the side menu. We'll call the function toggle left. To implement this on the controller, we need to bring in a service that will communicate with the side menus. This is the Ionic side menu delegate. Inject it as a dependency and create the toggle left function. All the toggle left function needs to do is call toggle left on the Ionic side menu delegate. At this point, we're just ready to write markup. Create the Ion side menus element with an Ion side menu. When we refresh, it's obvious something went wrong. Our side menu is sitting on top of our main content. This is because the side menu system has its own content element. If we create the Ion side menu content directive and place the header inside of it, we will now have a working side menu. In a formula, we will go over how to integrate the side menu with the rest of an Ionic application stack, including navigation, routing, and tabs.